guys. So, I'm going to make two videos. And this is going to be part one. And I thought this was going to be like a good and a bad. You know what I'm saying? Like, like I thought it was going to be one was going to be good and one was going to be like on second thought. It let me explain. I thought that was going to be what we was going to talk about. Because today, if you ain't know, you won't know. But I have a feeling most of y'all know. Hyrule Warriors came out for this system. Hyrule Warrior Legends came out for the 3DS. And I am a Zelda whore. Okay? <laughs> that sounds really weird. Let me explain. I have the Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask 3DS. New 3DS. I bought that bitch. I have the box for it right here. I'm not getting rid of the box. I keep the box it's right here. With all my 3DS stuff, I keep it. And I have pretty much every 3DS Zelda game you can have. The only one I don't have is Triforce Heroes. Okay? That means we have Majora's Mask. A Link Between Worlds. Ocarina of Time. And we just added Hyrule Warriors. Which is Hyrule Warrior Legends. We just added that today. We picked it up. Um, I went in before work and got my copy. I pre-ordered it and everything. Um, and for those of us who pre-ordered it, we got a special little art book of the um, new characters. In fact, this is a little nice little art book. It's a character book. It says character book right here on the front. I don't know if y'all can see that right here. Um, it shows off Toon Link. It shows off... Um, just a few other characters, nothing major. Um, and when I went to pick it up, he, I told him, you know, I was like, I'm here to pick up my Hyrule Warrior Legends 3DS copy, and he had it like this. And I was like, what is that? And he goes, oh yeah, you get a little art book. And I was like, oh, that's unexpected. That's kind of a nice little gift, considering when I pre-ordered it, I asked him if there was going to be a limited edition copy of the game, and he told me no. So I was happy that I got an art book because I kind of like getting the art books with Nintendo games. Um, now they did have this thing that I'm fixing to show y'all um, sitting there. Just kind of sitting on the counter like they normally do when a new game comes out. And I saw it and like a Zelda whore, he was like, would you like to purchase this? And I had to think about it for like all of 10 seconds. And of course I bought it and yes, I paid this dumbass price for it don't judge me um but i bought it just because i am a zelda whore i have the history of hyrule green hardback book somewhere um probably with all my other books but i bought the collector's edition guide yes bought this with it um i will not use the mobile friendly e-guides i just don't want that I don't care for that. Um, I, he was like, usually it comes with something, and this says collector's edition guide, so I'm imagining there's something in here. I haven't opened it yet. Um, I literally brought this home and went to work. Um, it looks like there's some artwork in here, to be honest with you. It looks like the last couple of pages, in fact, are artwork. Um, I know in the history of Hyrule, the green book that a few people have gotten or that a lot of people have I say a few just because I don't know I'm not even going to try to open that right now um but why why is why do I say that this is like it, it, it's kind of a good bad thing why, why would I say that um well when I'm playing it I notice the picture is kind of at a slant and I don't say that because, like, I'm holding the 3DS at an angle while I play. Like, I'm not looking at it like this. Okay? However, I noticed that the picture is at kind of like this angle. Even if I'm playing it where I can see it just fine. It's like, it's almost like it's a bad port. Like, I don't want to say it's a bad port, but it's almost like it's a bad port. Um, and that's really unfortunate because it's a first party game. This isn't a third party game. This is a first party game. This is a first party game, even though I know it's Dynasty Warriors, 
with a Zelda skin. Anything that comes out of Nintendo that is Nintendo property like Zelda should be a damn good port. Um, aside from this game, aside from A Link Between Worlds, damn good ports look incredible. Um, I have this on the 64 and this to me looks so, so much freaking better than the Nintendo 64 version. I do not own Majora's Mask on the 64 so I have no idea. I have no comparison. I don't have any base for comparison but Ocarina of Time um, for the 3DS, I prefer playing it on my 3DS. Um, it just, to me, holy shit. <laughs> but Hyrule Warriors is such a is such a bad port. It's I mean the the picture in it is dent dented. It, it it's not good at all. And while you're sitting there playing it and yes, it does look great for the resolution. It is high quality. It's just they did they do make a lot of mistakes in this port and it's very noticeable from the moment you turn it on. And that's, that's fucking sad. The fact that from the moment you turn it on, you can notice this. That's just fucking sad. Um, I mean, I enjoyed, I've been playing it. I haven't been putting, I haven't put a whole lot of time into it because like I said, I've, I have, uh, went out, got it and literally came home and put it in a room and went to work. So, um, right here it says that you get a bonus theme which I'm not going to show you the codes for because I kind of want to have a theme um, and it gives you a code for the ability to use um, new characters to the Wii U system so that's a bonus and it shows you the bonus characters right here on the back you have Skull Kid, Linkle Toon Link and two characters that I don't even really know the name of. Um, I have not played as Linkle yet. I kind of am excited to play as Linkle. Um, that was one of the reasons I bought the game. I kind of am like, yes, that's who I want to play as. Just because I want to see how the uh, crossbow handles. And I mean, like I said, I was kind of disappointed when I saw that the picture on the screen has been, I'm like, wow, this is sad. I was really looking forward to this game. And it just turned out to be not, it's so below par for what Nintendo does for any of their actual IP properties. You know what I mean? For their intellectual properties, which is what IP stands for. Um, so, I mean, let me know what y'all think. Do you have, did y'all run out by it today? Um, if so, let me know what you think in the comments below. I'm probably about to start playing some more of it because I actually do want to get through it. I don't own it on the Wii U. I'm going to be 100% honest with you. I don't own it on the Wii U. I bought it way back when it first came out, when I first got the Wii U, and I did not like it on the Wii U. I might, just for the simple fact that I can actually, um, use characters from this on the Wii U, might run out and purchase it used on the Wii U now. But I I personally see myself playing it more on a 3DS because I'm more a 3DS fan than a Wii U fan. Um, but let me know in the comment section, did y'all run out and buy it today? Um, if so, did y'all happen to notice that uh, bent picture in, in, in the game? Um, do you enjoy playing the port? Is it good for you? Are you enjoying it? Are you playing it in 3D? Are you playing it in 2D? Um, let me know in the comments, man. As always, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and I will talk to y'all later. Deuces.